So in an effort to make it uh, more quality and not quantity, <laughs> I'm okay. Proof of life today. Just a brief video. Uh, I, I, like I said in the Chomsky video, I'm, I'm focusing more on, uh, it's a time to listen and a time to talk. And uh, so I'm just listening right now. I'm working on some fairly interesting uh, quality clips. So you'll, you'll, I'll put that out soon. But right now is a wonderful, wonderful uh, uh, appearance. Trump, President Trump calls uh, Rush Limbaugh on his 30th anniversary party, right? Dials the phone, 15-minute talk. Fucking amazing, right? Listen to it. It's really, really good as, as far as any truth is concerned. Well, you know, he's Trump grossly misunderstands the numbers. He twists we're never doing so great. We're, we've never done so well. and all, It's all bullshit. Right? The economy... We're still in an oligarchy where the, where the corporations are bleeding people dry. But nonetheless, I think it's fascinating because Rush Limbaugh is, is loved by so many. Trump is loved by so many. And what is the love fest? I think that's the, the most, the, the, the takeaway from watching it is, is what is that love fest? Is, is it more important to be emotionally moved by a politician? Oh, I like this guy. I feel it. Right? But when, 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 when all the evidence suggests that he's lying to you to revive an economy by giving corporate tax breaks, that that people love the tax breaks, you listen to some of the the, the nonsense that uh, Trump is speaking in there. But he does it so elegant, eloquently, eloquently, excuse me, eloquently, right? as only a New Yorker can do. Right? And he's he's uh, it's high entertainment. So. Uh, you know, I, I put the link down below. It's it's right there. I, I linked it. Uh, I, I discovered it on uh, uh, True Pundit. So <clears throat> give True Pundit credit. It's follow it there. You I think you got to you read it and you scroll down. It's a bunch of bullshit pop ups, but <laughs> you'll find it. Limbar on um, Trump on Limbar. Amazing, you know, because I've never been a fan of Limbar. Right? I think he's, you know, mostly most of the time he's just an ignorant fat pig. You know. <laughs> He's high most of the time on something, but nonetheless, I, I I bring it I bring it into the mind stream because I'm fascinated by the the uh, the attraction of Trump, right? Uh, it, it's it's noble work. He's doing wonderful things in terms of crushing the media, but what he's doing is he's bringing it, in my view, in a in a very wrong direction because he's perpetrating the lie of trickle-down economics which the people that are raw 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 in the audience are never going to get a piece of that so I'll, i'm going to keep it to three minutes enjoy the video there's a lot more to come it's uh friday i think august 3rd and uh my name is marcus conti investigative journalist opinionist and candidate for the united states senate peace out